What we are doing now is to make sure that we have a skeleton staff. If, 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 we only, if we could operate and open a terminal, for example, in Belize with four people and one or two policemen that will be there to assist, then we will open a terminal in Belize City and throughout the country um, with the skeleton staff so we could deal with the arrival and departure of those uh, buses that, that will be allowed. And we, we are, I will get to how we are trying to assist them as well because all the bus operators, all of them, some of them completely stop running. Yeah. All of them. A lot of them completely stopped running. So by going and trying to shut down the rest of the, the ones that wanted to run and operate, uh, I think that was ludicrous. So what we are doing, we have some bus operators that is prepared to move those essential workers and those people who are in need of moving from one location to the other. We are asking, we are giving, we are offering for those on this list, major highways, major highways. You can't do the whole country mm -hmm. because we can't provide... Uh, uh, tax incentive or, or the uh, fuel uh, tax rebate to Bositos and everybody else. Mm -hmm. But major highways, now we are providing the, the, the tax exempt, I think, from half the fuel for another two to three weeks for those uh, operators that we have on this list. That, that yeah. starts and this, uh, this starts tomorrow. tomorrow. And okay. what will happen is that we are asking those operators not to even carry the 50 or 60 passenger on the bus. We are trying to help them, to help us, to help everybody else. So we are asking maybe 35, 40 people max, yeah. so you have adequate amount of space. However, in most cases, they need me to carry 30. Mm -hmm. yeah. In most cases, they need me to carry 30. I spoke to some operators this morning, and they were taking six. Okay. One operator took four people all the way from Corozal to Belize City. Yeah. So, so, so you're, you're saying that it's a genuine situation where the operator he, has chosen to, they, yeah, they, 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 to they not up, continue operating. It's not they're not to make money. It's not they profitable. They just want to make money and, and they can't and, keep the bus going. Yeah, and, and Rene, even if, you, even if you give some of the operators a full tank of diesel, and their responsibility is to at least make money to pay the driver and the conductor, they're still not making 